in your line of work, what would you explain to the public about what they're hearing in terms of what we're doing in port production today and some of the housing systems that we're using that they may have concerns about? If you could say something to the public that gives them insight that you know, you really wish people would ask you, but they don't. What would that be and what would you tell them? To Jed at uh, Legacy Farms, which is the pig adventure at, at, at Fair Oaks, was designed to show people how amazing a pig is. I, 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 uh, I love to talk the science about it in, in terms of how things happen. And we, we just work with the pig to do what they naturally want to do and, you know, day in and day out, if I'm ever out there uh, up above talking to the uh, tourists, it's like, man, you need to know our pigs are amazing. All pigs are amazing. That's one thing. The other thing is I want them to watch my people. I want them to, to look at what our people do and the, the individual care that they give to hundreds and thousands of animals. And I want them to wonder to themselves, how, how do they learn that? How, what are they sensing? What, what, what are they feeling about that animal as they're taking care of it every single day? And, and, and whether it's a, a, a sow that is ready to be bred, I mean, she's in heat and, um, you know, the, the people, the people have their hands on the animal to, to know what's going on with the animal. Um, I want people to look at the pig because the pig is really comfortable with people. And I want them to go, that's amazing that that animal does not, is not afraid, it's not panicky, it's comfortable with people. Now, how did that happen? Is it the people? And I, I would say yes. Is it the pig? I would say yes. But that interaction I find to be a fascinating thing. And I want them to be, to be able to walk away and go, uh, you know what, I don't have to worry about whether the, um, those people are taking care of that animal anymore. I can see it. I can, you know, when, when baby pigs are born and, and our employees are literally, you know, cleaning off the afterbirth and then blowing in their mouth, kind of like a, a mouth to mouth set sort of a thing, not exactly, but close to get, to get that first breath into that baby pig. If you can't see the passion that our people bring to that and therefore walk away and go, uh, I don't know I could check that one off my list. I know that they are taking great care of the animal. Mm -hmm. You know, your, your, your slides earlier today say, look, there's, there's one bad day. Whether it's harvest or slaughter, Nicole, we're over it. It happens, there's a bad day. And, and then we are able to pro provide food, fuel, and clothing for people based on what uh, the, the stewardship that we bring with that animal. That's the message I want people to have. 